Everyone's journey to the boardroom is unique, and mine is no different. I believe that my diverse experience spanning multiple sectors has allowed me to have a unique perspective, sort of connect different dots that helps and facilitates board discussions. I grew up in London, and like many Asian families, I was under no illusion that I was going to be a doctor, so I became a doctor. But soon afterwards, over time, I actually realized I was more interested in the economics of healthcare. When I first started thinking about my own opportunities, I had always been interested in technology. I've always been interested in innovation. Now, a farming is a company that I co-founded, and what's very exciting about this company is that, first of all, all of this technology is homegrown. A lot of diseases in the back of the eye are progressive diseases. They cause blindness. But because of the structure of the eyeball, in order to get the drug to the back of the eye, you cannot give it as eye drops. You actually have to give a very invasive injection right into the white of the eyeball. And what our core technology does is to deliver the drug to the back of the eye using ultrasound. And we hope to be able to use this technology uh, in the future. When looking for any position, opportunities don't necessarily fall into your lap. So I had done some research and thought that the listing committee did very interesting work. So I wrote directly to HKX and asked for an application form and applied directly to the Hong Kong Exchange. And um, that's how I started. At the listing committee and over the time that I've been on the listing committee, we've done a number of things which I think are very important for the state of the Hong Kong market. We need to make sure that the market stays current in terms of for issuers so that we can list the best of the companies here, but also provide investment opportunities for the investors. So we've done a number of things, including um, specialist technology companies, including SPACs. I think board diversity is very important. We are facing increasingly complex environment for business models and markets. And one of the things boards need to do is have different viewpoints and skills that different uh, board members bring to the board so that the company can leverage these different skills in order to manage the company in this more complex situation. I think increasingly there has been recognition that women have been underrepresented on boards and senior uh, management level, and that having more women on boards, more diverse opinions on board, it leads to better corporate governance. And there is some data sh shows that these companies do perform well. For women who are looking to get their first board role, I think it's very important to basically be proactive. So you have to make yourself amenable and be out there. You have to network and tell the people your network that you are seeking these positions. But at the same time, I think it's also very important to be able to understand what skill set do you bring to a particular board position or a board role. I think it's this sort of rich tapestry of skills that boards are looking for so that they can leverage uh, everyone's unique position in, on the board so that we can then have more inclusive and representative boards, which aids in good corporate governance.